In today's video, I will teach you how to invert a selection in GIMP. Let's get started. Inverting a selection in GIMP means selecting the pixels that were previously unselected and vice versa. Here are several ways to invert a selection in GIMP. The first method is by using the menu option. To create a selection, use any selection tool like rectangular, elliptical, or free select tool to create a selection. Now go to the menu bar, go to select, then invert. This will invert the current selection. The second method is by using the keyboard shortcuts. Use any selection tool to create a selection. Then press Ctrl I or Command I to invert the selection. The third method is by right clicking the context menu. Use any selection tool to create a selection. Now, right click on the image, then from the context menu, choose Select, then Invert. The fourth method is by using the selection menu. Use any selection tool to create a selection, then go to the menu bar, then go to Select, and from the drop down menu, choose Invert. The next method is by using the quick mask mode. Press Q to enter quick mask mode, then use the paintbrush tool to paint the unselected area, and the painted area will turn into a red overlay. Then press Q again to exit quick mask mode, and the painted area will now be the selected portion. The next method is by using the select by color tool. Use the select by color tool to select a color in your image, and with the color selected, Go to the menu bar, go to select, then invert. Choose the method that fits your workflow or preferences. Each of these methods achieves the same result, selecting the opposite of the current selection in your GIMP project. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.